Hi, this is Thomas from Mars Moon Space TV. We are back on the moon and we are looking at an image from the Lunar Orbiter 5 series. And this is an amazing image. I think already now, if you're looking probably at this image you're looking at here, you will see something is fishy on this image. And I have... Uh, <laughs> I've cheated a little bit, so I have prepared a, an image with some color to, to show what I'm seeing in this image. And there is a lot of things going on. I think we're looking at an inhabited moon here. And by uh, changing the colors a little bit, uh, making the bright a little bit brighter, you can actually hide a lot of stuff. I think that's what NASA done here, but, but they have done a, a poor job here to hide stuff here. And there is a lot of things going on in this image. This is taken from a distance of 220 kilometers and zoomed in on my software. Let's have a look at the colors. In the middle, you see a round ring, actually two round ring with something I pointed out in gray. And just below it, you have another round something sitting down there and there is a little pipe going up to, to, to this object here. We're, we're gonna zoom in on it in just a few seconds. Uh, look to the left in this picture. We're gonna have a closer look at that also. It's like somebody or someone or something carved into the mountains and built some constructions inside the mountains. You're gonna see that in just a minute, if you can see it already now. This is a really, really, truly awesome picture. And the first time I saw it, I was speechless. So, what are you saying guys? Should we have a look at the Photoshop software so we can enhance it? Let's go for it. And here we have the picture in the software so we can zoom a little bit on it and if we start over in, in the <laughs> on the left side here the, there are two objects over here and I don't know how to describe them but, but the one to the left actually seems like they have a triangular uh, shape constructions uh, with something added to it <laughs> Uh, and the other one looks like something from out of a <laughs> sci-fi <laughs> movie. I, I, I don't know what we are looking at, but it seems kind of out of place when you're looking at, uh, uh, at the rest of the area. And again, if you go down here, there is these odd lines going here and this edge going over here that seems to be smooth all the way around. Uh, I have no idea what, what the purpose of, of this one is, but, but there must be some kind of purpose. <laughs> but looking down here at this area here, let's just zoom in a little bit here, a little bit more. It looks like somebody carved a square entrance into the mountains and two objects is actually parked here on the ground that seems to be smoothed out. Uh, are we looking at an entrance into to, to, uh, to the mountain? Uh, if we are, these two objects here must be some kind of craft. I don't think we are looking at, at, at objects with wheels on the moon. <laughs> Not at all. Nothing with wheels would, would, would work on the moon. We are uh, looking at uh, vehicles that can uh, fly, uh, so to speak, hover, fly, whatever. Uh, it's, it does look like there is some kind of a, an, an entrance here, uh, and just like we see those pictures from <laughs> from the S4, you know, I know it's an uh, animated picture, but, but seeing them again, this uh, reminds me of the, uh, the animated pictures from uh, Area 51 and the S4 hangar, where they carved the, uh, the hangar into the mountainside. And again, over here, look at this one here. It looks like somebody actually just removed part of the mountain and started building something inside of it and and up here is something is that a kind of lid you can roll down over here <laughs> what are we looking at here it does to me look like there is some construction inside of it here with 90 degree angles and this cylinder shape formed here in, in, in the middle 
And again at the bottom here we have these 90 degree angles and uh, platforms down here and it looks very artificial created and again I, I cannot state what we are looking at but, but to me it looks like somebody carved or built uh, a construction in the mountain uh, by the mount uh, uh, by using the, the, the mountain itself to carve in but again I don't know this is just what I'm seeing uh, and up here we have these 90 degree angles here I, I don't know if uh, that's a construction or, or, or just a part of the edge uh, of uh, this uh, construction here uh, but it seems very uh, artificially created and, and going down to the area down here you see it's all smoothed out uh, what is going on down here uh, again we have this edge around here and then we have this object over here uh, it looks like a building with a square roof a uh, smooth a plain uh, roof and just next to it we have this round area, just like uh, a hospital. We have a, a helicopter platform where uh, the helicopter can, can, can land and, and take off. Uh, are we looking at something similar to that? Because uh, looking at, at, at the rest of the image here, it, it looks really, really suspicious. It's thinking of that we are on <laughs> the moon, guys. Uh, the moon that uh, has no life, uh, according to, to NASA. But not according to, to the whistleblowers around in the world. The area over here looks looks really, really suspicious and, and, and uh, fishy, especially this area where, where it looks like two objects is actually going in or out of, of the mountain. And what are we looking at here? This really is uh, intriguing because it does really look like somebody really just removed, let's get close, removed part of the mountain and build something inside it and again looking at the area with the, what I call a helicopter uh, pad over here uh, and, and uh, it to me it looks like a building standing over here it it seems it seems uh, pretty uh, <laughs> artificial cr constructed if, if you ask me <laughs> uh, going to the middle of the picture you have the area up here and I haven't been looking the whole image through. Uh, I only looked at, at, at what I have pointed out here. Uh, there is this object in the middle. It seems out of place. And again, it seems like we have this round foundation here. Could there have been a dome here for many years ago? And this was maybe part of the foundation and, or, or, or what's left of it? Uh, I don't know. I, I don't know and again we have a round uh, one over here also just next to the big one here but it does look pretty suspicious uh, in my eyes thinking of that we are on the moon and this is this I don't know if this is a, a, a part of the mountain or if it's, it's something separate that actually just has been placed there but it looks like a huge round object uh, with some triangular uh, holes and square holes in it, uh, uh, laying on, on this platform. We're looking at here, and there is this pipe going down from the objects. <laughs> it's getting more and more mysterious. And, and again, next to to the object over here, we have this area with these walls, and there are lots of walls. I've only pointed out uh, a few of them. And this half round construction just right here. It's seems pretty strange and, and, and pretty odd uh, going down to the area over here we have these again 90 degree angles uh, constructions of uh, buildings it looks like it and looking at this area it seems like there is a round object integrated in the mountain and, and look at this gray area that i pointed out here it seems like it's half round and there is an opening and at the end and again there are two vehicles you can just see let me just get closer. I always forget how close I can come. Sorry. You can just see two objects at the end of this entrance here. Are there uh, craft coming uh, in or out? And again, over here, you see this building here and an opening. Uh, what are we looking at? It seems pretty odd and, and, and pretty strange. Uh, these two objects here uh, seems pretty clear to me that they are actually uh, coming out of this area here and are on its way uh, to somewhere, uh, but where <laughs> we don't know. We don't know. But again, it's truly amazing. We have 
an object over here and that looks like and it probably is not but it looks like a gun turret of a kind <laughs> uh, but i don't think it is uh, i couldn't help it i have to point it out and again a new area here with, with what looks like when you're looking on google earth uh, looking at a city or uh, an area uh, all these 90 degree angles constructions uh, pathways uh, it looks pretty strange to me uh, and, and, and pretty much out of place and not to forget over here in the right corner there is this object that i also point out in gray here uh, with a long pipeline after or, or i don't know what we're looking at here but what it seems kind of uh, out of place uh, i want to thank uh, my good friend chris moroni from mars anomaly for bringing this picture up he was the guy who actually uh, took it up there is another thing in this image that i haven't pointed out with colors but it's actually pretty awesome look at this object here it's a huge cylinder shaped object my bad that I didn't point it out, I just saw it when, when I was uh, supposed uh, to start <laughs> the video. But there is a huge cylinder shaped object with an opening right here in the middle. What could it be? Could it be something that actually was flying or is it an integrated part of the mountain or construction or something? I don't know. And over here you see this flat wall just going up here. Uh, the whole picture seems uh, <laughs> pretty weird actually <laughs> and there are, as I said before, so many things in, in, in this image uh, and I probably only pointed out a, a little percentage uh, of the things that is in this image. So guys, here you have it, uh, the inhabited moon, if you ask me, we are looking at the leftovers uh, of something that once was, or probably still is, but it just looks like something that we cannot uh, imagine with our uh, way of thinking here on planet Earth. Um, I think we are looking at an inhabited area and, and something strange is actually going on. Are we looking at the moon area 51 <laughs> or are we looking at something else? Well, the questions are many and we we'll probably never get an answer to all of them. But until we do, we can only speculate and to me this looks like an inhabited area of the moon. Until we see you again guys, take care, bye.